Oh, hey, I uh, didn't see you there. Welcome back, everybody. My name is Subpar Citrus, and we're playing Paper Mario still. Well, you know that, because you clicked on the episode. What the fuck are you doing watching the second one over the first one? We're going to go see what's up with this toad. If you remember, I said he was probably getting sucked. Stop it. My, my beautiful colors. Goodness, what's that thing doing to him? Mario, help me. I, I can't feel my pants. That sucks, bro. But I did find something that might come in handy. Now is not the time for innuendos, Toad. Take these and remember me. Fondle me. Yeah, what did I just say? Handy? Fondle? You got a bunch of cards! Dope! And then he was sucked to death. Just how every toad wants to go out. <gasps> oh. Dude! No! Poor toad! What are you waiting for, Mario? Use those battle cards on this sucker! Yeah, battle cards! Here he comes! He's gonna suck you good, Mario. Hold it! Do you even have any paint, Mario? Uh, and what? Wait. Wait. You know, paint? That colorful stuff coursing through our bodies? No? I think that's blood. Uh, give me a second here, shy guy. You got... I wonder if the straw is built into the mask as I put my hand directly over my face. That means mask. <laughs> what are we going to do? There's no paint around here. Ah, oh, there's no other choice. Mario, you're going to have to ring me out. Just press A to give me a squeeze. Don't be shy now. Oh. Oh, fuck, Mario. Oh, yeah, that's the stuff. And then he became paper. That's how that works. You take your paint can and you just... And then it's paper. Whoa, I'm so light and airy. Is this what you paper folk feel like all the time? All right, enough flapping in the wind. Just like a beehole. The paint you just absorbed is basically my blood, sweat, and tears. And maybe a little semen. But you'll get over that. You'll have time to shower later. That's, that's a line I've used. <laughs> use that paint to power up those battle cards your friend gave you. And then use the battle cards to plaster this introverted assassin. Well, he's called his buddies. Hey, so... We're just gonna go ahead and attack you now? I mean, if that's cool. If you're ready. No, that's definitely not cool! And since when are there three of you? Whatever. We got cards. We got paint. You know what to do, Mario. Sure. <laughs> uh, do you have any fives? You have no idea what to do, do you? No worries. Uncle Huey's here to give you a primer. All right. This is the core mechanic of the game. So you can't see it, but I'm going to show it up to the screen. Maybe that... So, Huey's telling me what to do here on the screen, right? Fuck Huey! He don't know shit! I know what I'm doing, and I'm gonna show you what to do. Here's how it all works. So, first off, let's take a look at our deck of cards that our dying toad friend left for us. This is our battle deck. Just like any battle deck, it's got your standard cards. Kings, queens, jacks, aces, and my personal favorite, hammer. Step one. You select the card it is you want to use. In our case here, we're going to choose our trusty hammer. Step two. Now you take your selected card and, you guessed it, paint the shit out of it. This is where the game truly shines. Make sure to paint it completely or else what the fuck is the point? Step three. Now that we have our cards selected and painted, it's 
time for that classic Paper Mario gameplay. Wait for the right timing, and... You crack your enemy's skulls and read the rewards. And that's everything you need to know about murdering your enemies in Color Splash. It's just that easy. And there you got it! See? This game's easy peasy once you get a hang of the whole battle system. Color me impressed, you're a natural kid. I know it. Man, I'm starving. How about that burger? Huh? Don't worry about Toad there, he'll be fine. What you mean, he'll be fine? Walk off, bud! Hmm. Maybe he's in rougher shape than I thought. But no worries, he just needs a fresh coat of paint and he'll be good as new. Really? You can revive him with paint? That would be a miracle. He won't come back as some kind of freaky zombie toad, right? No, ma'am. He'll be the same toad he's always been. That's the power of paint, baby. That's the power of Ponsol. You see, paint isn't just for powering up battle cards. Paint adds beauty and life to the world. So I've taken the liberty of loading up your hand. <laughs> so I've taken the liberty, because he sounds like Foghorn Leghorn. Well, I say, I say, that's just, I've taken the liberty to load up your paint. Load your hammer up with the colors of the rainbow. Taste the paint. <laughs> Don't eat paint, kids. Go on, press X to give her a swing. Aim for your pasty friend here. I will have you know that I've had plenty of pasty friends, thank you. Just five more minutes, Mom. Wait, what? I'm alive! He just vomits paint everywhere. Yeah, I can feel my pants! Yeah! Ew, dude, I'm so glad you're okay. Without your colors, we could hardly read you. See? That's the power of paint! <laughs> now I've got to warn you. I gave you everything I've got, but it won't last forever. If you want to keep on painting the world around you, you got to have, the have to resupply from time to time. So, this can here just saved my life. I knew all that recycling would pay off one day. Hey, just in case we get ambushed by any more freaks with bendy straws. Where exactly are we supposed to find this magical life-giving paint you speak of? Yeah, that's true. He's like a fucking necromancer raising people from the dead, but with a paintbrush. My next D&D &D character. Easy. Remember that fountain in the center of town? You know, the one where I was taking a nap? Well, it's the prime source of all paint of Prism Island. We've got six big paint stars hooked up to that thing and they'll put out as much paint as you like. Plus, I mean, paint pretty much flies out of everything around here. Try hitting stuff with your hammer. You'll see what I mean. Ew, that's wonderful news. I was a little worried because the fountain looked completely dry when we woke you up. Yeah, so I guess we just need to turn it on or something, right? It was definitely dry when we got there. <laughs> Dry? Good one, Toad. Mario, you might want to give this guy another whack with that hammer. I mean, dry? Please. Our big paint stars can never run dry. Come on, I'll show you. Come on! Paint stars? I don't know what a paint star is, but I definitely didn't see anything like that. Mario, there's another colorless figure over there. We can't just leave him like that. What should we do? Uh, we should whack him with a regular hammer because he sucks. Oh shit, I just, I almost killed my friend, because that's all she thinks of me. Welcome to Prisma Card Wait, what's going on? Last time I remember, I was surrounded by a bunch of thirsty shy guys. Mario! Nah, there's no way Mario could come all the way out, would come all the way out to Prism Island. What are you, some sort of Mario impersonator or something? Because it's so great job. How much you make for a gig like this? Eight? Nine coins an hour? Anyway, stop by my shop in the Blue District sometime and pick up some battle cards. Oh yeah, and if you find the shy guys who stole my cards, turn them into scrap paper. That's fucked up. That'd be like if I turned you into an actual card. Boop! Alright, paint! Paint me up, Dad! Hey, Mario. Nice work with those battle cards. I gotta say, though. Your action command game is looking a little, uh, sketchy. If you ever want to practice, just stop by my, uh, yeah, dojo. Uh, I mean, house. Not, not drug, not crack house. Or we could, uh, just hang out and watch movies or whatever. Go surround sound. No 
Won't be weird. Yeah, sure. Mm hmm. Won't be weird. Well, that's a weird uh, block, but you know, cool, 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 cool. Wapap. Wapap. Dope. All right, give me red. I need red. Where's the red at? There, B. Well, that's orange, but close enough. Right? Nope. All right. Well, we are going to see if there are actually paint stars where Huey said there are. Spoiler alert, there's not. He just didn't notice because he's a big, dumb idiot. But if you enjoyed the episode, I got to not point with a stylus. It's like chopsticks, right? It's, it's rude and improper. But if you like the video, go ahead and click that like button. If you want to see more videos from me, go ahead and click that subscribe button. And until then, I will see you in the next episode. See you then. Ha, ha, ha.